All right, so I guess it was a year or two ago, I picked up this little heater. Um, it's like a double heater and I'll show you here in a second, but um, I'm, I had to pick up an adapter to get the thing to work with like a regular size, I don't even know what size it is, uh, propane tank, one of those little camping propane tanks. Anyhow, I'm gonna just have to create like a little makeshift uh, wood stand here just so I can plug this thing in. No, it's just so I can plug this thing in and use it while we're hunting here during the holiday hunt. Okay, so I made a little stand for this thing. Nothing fancy, but just so it stands up and it's, we're not at risk of the thing tipping over when we're not looking. We'll give it a shot here in just a second. But it's pretty simple. This has a little adapter that connects the, uh, this little tank here, the propane tank. The 14 ounce tank, I guess, is the size. And then it adapts to this little uh, uh, hose that has a little regulator up top. Pretty straightforward. I'll try it out here, see how it works. Okay, so I just fired this thing up. Actually, it really is warm. I can't believe how warm it is. I have it on low right now. And this is almost heating up this section of the garage. So when I'm using this in the deer stand, in that little nine by 12, I think I need to keep it on for just a few minutes and then turn it off. That'll last for a while. Um, I guess the only thing I wonder about is if the deer might be able to smell, you know, because this stuff's pretty smelly. Anyways, I think this will work out though. I'll give it a shot here this week. And I just kind of climbed up here on a really cold day up to the deer stand. It's actually, it's about 10 degrees. My little thermometer up here in the wall, which I just mounted with a screw, isn't quite showing that it's 10 degrees yet because the thing was in my pocket. So I want to wait for that thing to cool down just a little bit. And then I'm going to kind of run a test here and see how long it takes for this little system that we built to, to warm it up. You know, to warm it up in here just so it's comfortable enough. Also, I'm hoping that it'll be five, 10 minute bursts, you know, and then we can turn the thing off. Um, but I'm gonna test it out and see. So, yeah, it's really cold here today. It's, I think, eight degrees technically right now, and the wind is whipping. And so the wind chills are, I think, 10 below zero, maybe a little bit more at times. But yeah, I'll test this thing out and see what happens. All right, so we just got this thing fired up. It's on high. Um, it immediately it makes a difference. You feel the heat immediately. <laughs> but the real question is, when will this thing Will the needle start to move on that thing? Um, we're not convinced we're starting. I don't think that's the right temperature to begin with, but nonetheless, we should see that thing go up. I would hope to 25 or 30 you know, degrees within five or 10 minutes. So we'll keep an eye on it. Okay, well, it went for about I'd say five minutes and we gained about seven degrees, give or take. And that was at full blast. And then right about that time is when we started to get low on fuel in this tank and one of the burners went out. And this one's still going, but it's basically on low. Um, it's worth mentioning too, that when I came up here, there were seven, maybe eight, look like does that I kind of kicked them up and started them. <laughs> okay, so I just put a new um, tank of gas on there. Now it's really cooking fast. Um, I think I just started on a half empty tank or probably less than a quarter tank. So anyways, we're just testing this out make sure that this works for when we come up here in a day or two. But so far so good a lot better and uh, 
a lot more comfortable. Alright, so the heater worked out pretty well. Um, Doug and I are going to go up there tomorrow. And you might recognize Doug. He Anyways, we're going to go up tomorrow and see if we can get uh, a dough. We're going to go up on the 27th too, see if we get, see if we can eat, get, each get a couple doughs actually. And uh, we'll keep you posted on how well that heater works. It's pretty cold today. It's like, what was it, high of 18? Probably 12 degrees right now. Yeah. So anyhow, hopefully uh, that work we put into the heater is going to pay off. But uh, anyways, we'll keep you posted if we get a deer. And, We'll share it if we can.